After weeks of practice, the fourth-ranked Frogs entered the stadium pumped and ready to fight the sixth-ranked Broncos for what would be TCU's first BCS bowl game win. TCU was predicted to win by seven points, but after what ESPN called a gutsy fake punt from Boise, the Frogs were unable to recover in the fourth quarter. They outcoached us on that play. It was a good, it was a good call. They made an adjustment. Uh, we had a guy on him. But uh, they fanned and he came inside and we had, we had worked on the play. And we, they'd actually called it off once uh, in the first half. They had it in on their, about their 35 yard line. So, uh, you gotta, like I said, you got to give them a little bit of credit. BSU won 17 to 10. There was, you know, the students were in Arizona, they were having a great time going out, getting, getting a taste of what was, what was out there um, the nights before. But I know everyone that I knew went home afterwards and just went to bed because. It was a, just a really disappointing loss. I, I don't. I think they expected, for, since they showed up, I, th I think they expected the team to show up a little bit more. The Frogs walked back to the locker room while Boise State fans celebrated. I take a lot of part for the loss, but uh, we got to be, we got to expect that against a team like Boise, you can't have that many mistakes. We did a lot of good things this year. Um, you know, we'll, we'll understand that, but we also have the, you know, the foul taste in the mouth that we have after this game. It's, you know, all these underclassmen, um, you know, we're going to take this and just make it motivation for next year. And, uh, you know, hopefully we can, uh, you know, really improve and you know, win a big game like this. Frogs finished sixth in the BCS rankings, with Boise State jumping to the number four spot. Reporting from TCU in Fort Worth, I'm Patty Espinosa, Palestra.net, The College Network.